Hey everyone, look what finally came in. It's the new Digivice from the new anime. So let's have a quick overview of this box because it is very, very nice. There's Agumon on the front. I think the back's just the basic stuff. There's the new logo for the new anime. Looks like we're gonna need three batteries. And let's open this up and have a look. Ooh, that looks so good. Look at that gold. All right, let's take this out. Let's have a quick look at the instructions. Seems simple enough. So I think there's just stuff about how it lights up, how to put the back cover on, some other generic information. There's the back, back cover stuff. And a QR code, I guess, for more instructions and then telling us about the battery. So yeah, that's just a flyer. Seems like we got the same thing in the Pendulum Zs. All right, let's open this up. back we can see that we need three triple A's luckily we have that this thing's a lot bigger than I was expecting it to be Ooh, pretty lights all right let's get the back cover on wow those lights are bright Okay. So you're gonna do that again? Ooh, pretty. I don't know if my camera can take it. Okay, so I'm pretty sure this is up and down. Uh, to begin with, you get Agumon or Gabumon. It doesn't really matter which one you pick. Uh, it's just gonna be your walking partner. Walking? Walking? We don't really have a pedometer in this thing. Um, I'm gonna go Gabumon, but we can switch to Agumon uh, straight away. So these are the only two we can start with. We can find everything else later. Well, it's not focusing. <laughs> there we go. My camera is not gonna cooperate with that. There we go. This thing is loud. All right, okay. Let's see how we go through. So I'm gonna guess this is the, yeah. So here is where I was saying you can just go through and select either Agumon or Gabumon or any of the other Digimon partners that you find later on. So you can encounter them later. Um, so, there's information on Gabumon. Oop, can't go that way. Nope. Okay. And then, yeah. We go to... I guess we're in the other stages. So then you can check your wins. Uh, if you fill this meter up, you can evolve. I'm pretty sure. Just going off other digivices I've been through. Um, let's scroll through. So this is the battling area, we'll go through that in a second. The options, so sound, I'm going to guess that is lights, those are the two options there. We'll keep those on, and then we're back to partners, so that's three menus really, there's not much there. Uh, so yeah, let's get into this, let's go do the first area, have a go. So it's based on a quest mode, which you can see all the areas here, and a roulette wheel system. Cool sounds from the uh, anime. So I guess we get to pick who we want. So I'll just choose Gabumon. Okay, so normally there'll be a lot more options here, but because we're only at Gabumon, we uh, can only really pick the first one, which is attack. Ooh, I'm not good at this. I need to not look at this through the uh, through the camera because I'm gonna miss it. But we might win this anyway. Well, that was easy enough. And there's the first area clear. Well, that was easy enough, so... There's nice animation there. Okay, let's do another stage, because that was way easier than I was expecting. Same enemy. I'm going to try to do this, not through the camera, see if I can uh, get that roulette wheel right. 
Ooh, not quite. This is harder than it looks, but... <laughs> okay, that just determines the power of your attacks. Yeah. I have noticed that this is very loud. Um, let's have a look at the sound menu, see if there's an optional... Where is it? This one? It's on or off. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, we'll keep it on for now, but yeah. Oh, cool. So if you hit the C button, you can see both your partners. Do they do anything else? Oh, it's just little animations. It's cute. Anyway, let's do a size comparison. This is the new Pendulum Z, and that's about the size. This thing's very thick. Um, I honestly probably should have grabbed one of my Digivices to compare it to, but yeah, there's no clip on this thing. Um, that's another thing, because in the new anime they kind of just hold it. It is a good size for your hand, an adult hand anyway. I feel like they know who they were marketing this thing for. Um, I think this would be huge in a child's hand. But yeah, that's pretty much the basics of this device. There's honestly not that much to it. It's just a quest mode uh, thing. Let's do one more of the quest mode things. Let's fight it with Agumon this time. Ooh. Let's go Agumon. Uh, I'm not good at this. <laughs> okay, I thought that was the evolution of the other guy. So I might struggle because I didn't actually hit very high on the... on the roulette wheel. <laughs> Well, that's our first loss. Let's see what it looks like to lose. Oh wow, that is so very loud. <laughs> okay, cool. Um, so I'm gonna go grab my other Digivice and uh, we're gonna see the size comparison because uh, this is a thick, thick boy. <laughs> okay, so this is the Metal Garurumon version 15th version. Uh, this is probably the closest thing to uh, the the Ver Complete that will be coming out later and is it the start of next year? Um, so that's a comparison about this is pretty much what you'll be getting uh, if you get the Ver Complete instead of this one So on the back of this one, there's a clip uh, It's very thick like very thick and a lot bigger too Well, maybe not that much bigger. It's a little bit bigger if you just line them up next to each other So yeah so there's a good that much <laughs> in between. But yeah, that's uh, the comparison between the two in size. Um, yeah, I don't know, I, I think I would still prefer something like this. Um, I also prefer the pedometer that you can shake and uh, walk with. Of course, you're meant to walk with them. Um, this one is just a mini game. I can see, you know, how people would like just the mini game if they don't have the time to do a walking pedometer. Um, but also it's just a cool little mini game and a really good display piece. So I feel like some people would really like this because it looks nice on a shelf, which is fair. Um, but yeah, it would have been nice if there was some kind of connectivity or if some kind of like Bluetooth or infrared that we could use uh, with like a foreign app or something. That would have been really nice to do. Uh, this pretty much is just a fancy CSA digivice, so people that don't know what CSA is, uh, means cl complete animation uh, digivice, uh, which are just the ones that have light and lights and sounds, except this one has lights, sounds, and a minigame of clearing the battle area. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much all. I will be doing a playthrough on, these one, uh, on this one. I'll pretty much be continuing where we left off on this video. Uh, but I will just be putting up. I think we'll clear every area. We'll see how long it takes. See how hard this thing is. I'm sure I'll figure out the format eventually. Anyway, that's it for now. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye for now.